Hi guys, it's reaction time. We're gonna do a bit of a retro one. We're gonna go back uh, to a band called Washed and I Need an Angel. This came from Paul. So um, it's from 1991. Another perfect time, you know, to choose a reaction for. Found a lot of music, guys, um, you know, including things like Heaven's Edge for me that I didn't really know a lot about at the time. Didn't, you know, didn't hear a lot about these bands back then because, you know, you know what happened in the early 90s. So I'm sure this is another one that's been forgotten about. So it's Washed, I Need an Angel. They only had one album out, I believe, in 1991. So just come and gone, just as quick as that, obviously, because of what was happening with the music scene. So... Don't know a lot about the band, but I thought, you know what I mean? I've got a little bit of time. I haven't got a lot of time, so I'll just get on with doing some, maybe a couple of old ones. So this is Washed and I Need an Angel. Here we go. Man, <laughs> it's brilliant. It's brilliant, and it, again, it makes me sad. 1991. I mean, are this band doing anything else? Did they do anything else after this? I hope they fucking did, man. Oh, they just sound brilliant. They sound typical for that time. The, the bands that I've found after not knowing about them. Do you know what I mean? They sound typical of those brilliant sort of suggestions that you guys have been making from those long-lost early 90s bands. Probably, you know, doing, at the time, probably doing well in Japan and nothing here in, in the UK. I didn't even hear of them at the time, but just what a vocalist as well. Just can reach, like, screaming, like, you know, just effortlessly and with power. I love the little acoustic guitar part, uh, the bridge to the chorus. I love that. I mean, that's what it's all about, going to acoustic guitar. Never be able to do it live, probably. You wouldn't be able to switch that quick. <laughs> but you could do it in the studio. They're brilliant to hear the, that acoustic guitar coming in just before the chorus. Really upbeat. When it came on, I thought it was going to be a little bit funky. This is what I didn't know what to think. Then it straight away, it was bang. It was into the song. Led you into a bit of um, false sense of security, I think, that beginning bit. Then it was bang into the song. Then the lovely acoustic bit, like I said. Then back into a brilliant chorus musicianship again off the fucking charts just just brilliant remind me a little bit of he heaven's edge actually a little bit they do remind me a little bit of them just just fantastic stuff the bands man in the early 90s that just amazing stuff it's fucking brilliant i'm so glad i you know when i get to sit down and do some older ones nearly everything and 90 percent of what i hear is just 
it blows me away and makes me sad at the same time. Let's listen to the rest. Wow, man. Fuck. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh man! Fucking hell, man. That was absolutely brilliant. Imagine if that, I've said this before, imagine if that got released now. Because a lot of, obviously, this sort of music is becoming popular again. You know, amongst the rock and metal community, it's coming back. It's come back, been back a few years now, and that would be a release in half. You know, if you heard that now, if it came out now on Frontiers or whatever label it was, you know, it would just, it would just fucking be, it would blow you away. It really would. And you'd think that, it's just a quality song. It's got the right heaviness. It's got lovely, beautiful acoustic passages throughout the song. I love the solo, by the way. The solo was just mind blowing. And when it died down at the end, to go again to go into an acoustic bit, just brilliant. Some excellent guitar melodies, like little twin lead parts, just throughout guitar melodies. Just brilliant, <laughs> absolutely brilliant. Washed. I need an angel. Another classic from the early '90s. Amazing song. Let me know, guys. Have you heard of this band? Is this the first time you've heard them? What do you think of that excellent song from the early 90s? Let me know in the comments below, please. And I'll see you soon.